Good morning. We're here with Dennis. Dennis is the owner and proprietor of this beautiful spot called Back Road Berries. And Back Road Berries, if you look over here, uh, beautiful strawberries. <laughs> and how, Dennis, this is quite, how long have you been doing this? Just We started this about 10 years ago. About 10 years ago? Yeah. We <laughs> farmed our whole lives and we retired in, in 09 from the truck farming okay and we started this you picked and it's just grown it's we started it's amazing. With, this was all blackberries at one time oh okay and, uh, people wanted a few blueberries so we put some in and then yeah. they wanted strawberries and we put some in <laughs> put some in when you say some about how many uh, strawberry plants do you have out here there's about seventeen thousand seventeen thousand mm -hmm. oh my gosh i just did a little scan here so people can see what we're talking about seventeen thousand strawberry plants oh my goodness so you you must list me hundreds of thousands of berries oh yeah i mean yeah. just these things will pick they're they won't get heavy picking until the end of january really and they'll pick january february and march that's when you the okay. peak of your crop comes right. in. right now it's just a day or two a week but it'll soon be almost every day yeah wow that's amazing so and then that the other thing is the irrigation system. Oh, but the back, let me back up a minute. You're, if you look at these rows, they are absolutely straight as an arrow. And I keep looking at them and say, how the heck did he get these <laughs> plants and the, uh, the uh, black plastic he got down to get the, the, the plants in there? How, how do you get them so straight? My son has GPS on his equipment and I conned him into laying off the rows for me <laughs> <laughs> they just come out perfect so uh, the, yeah. it's gps satellite controlled and they get these rows looking yeah. there's nobody could ever make these rows as straight as i'm looking i mean no, it's just it'd impossible be, it'd be hard yeah it'd be very <laughs> difficult so so what do you do do you sell just to people to come over That's and pick it. a strictly you pick we'll pick them for people if they want them yeah. picked but we're strictly you pick we do no commercial Back Road Berries. Do you have a website or anything? Yes. Or you do. Back Road Berries, right? Back, back Road Berries. And you can find out when you're open and they can get on your mailing list and people yeah. can... It, there's, a, there's a subscribe button on the... And all oh, they have okay. to do is hit that subscribe button and they'll... We only send out emails a couple of days before we pick. Other than that, we don't bother you. <laughs> okay. Oh, good. So people will know what yeah. days yeah. picking is allowed and what hours you're going to be open. That's yeah. perfect. All right. Dennis, Back Road Berries. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Thanks for coming out. All right. You're welcome. <laughs> Just outside the villages, about two miles, three miles outside the villages. That's it. Wonderful spot. Hi. Good morning. Heck yeah. How are you? Good morning. Good morning. How, How are you, you doing? This morning? Good. Oh, I'm doing great. I need a pail. All right. I'll just take anyone. Okay. So, happy New Year. How are you? So the, the idea here, I know what it is, but for people that don't know it, right. you get yourself a pail, and you get one of these pails, and uh, obviously tip it over to the other side. There you go. Put your strawberries in here. And then we weigh it when you get back. You weigh it when you get back. We have a set price on the berries depending okay. on what type of berry you're picking. Okay. And you pay from there. Perfect. Mm -hmm. All right, I see the early birds are on the move. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> yes, <sir. laughs> All right, walking out here, I got my pail. These uh, blackberries, I think, over here, they'll be out later. Loads of blackberry plants, as you can see. And uh, there's the early bird crowd up there getting ready to pick their strawberries. 17,000 plants. I'm sure there's enough strawberries for everybody in all around the whole entire area, I would think. So all you do is lean over <laughs> and pick one of these beauties. How nice is that? Well, look at these bubbas. Here's another one right here. down here a little further 
There's a beauty right there. I'll take that one. I always check the bottom of the berry. Sometimes they, if they've been out here a while, I might have a little um, rot on the bottom, but these are perfect. Oh my gosh, look at these things. Huh? Look at this. Oh, yikes. There's a beauty right there. Yep. Here's another one right here. Oh my gosh, look at this thing. Look at this thing. Let me put my hand. <clears throat> I've got big hands, but look at my hands down next to that. The palm of your hand. <laughs> wow. All right, that's all I need for now. That'll last me till the next pick. Took the drone down today while we're there and took some drone footage. Thought you might like to see the farm from a different view. With right now I'm flying along some of the rows of strawberries, of the 17,000 strawberry plants. I'm going to fly all the way to the end of the farm as we start getting down here a little bit further. We're going to catch a little bit of altitude to give you a little better look. So hopefully we'll start to go up a little bit right about here. We should start gaining some altitude. There we go. And is the back end of the farm and over to the right of course blackberry and blueberry plants and they'll be coming later on in the year but for the next three months now we're going to have plenty right here two miles outside of the villages how do you beat this back road berries two mile drive and we're picking beautiful fresh strawberries for the next two or three months great yeah, there's a web address right on the bottom there too if you need that. We had a great time today. Thanks to Dennis and everybody over there at Back Road Berries.